Well, good morning, good morning, everybody. I tell you, how y'all doing this morning? This is the coolest morning <laughs> I'll ever have today. But uh, whew. but anyway, I thank and praise God for waking me up, and uh, I thank and praise God for being God. I love it, <laughs> cool and all. Amen. Uh, I just want to get on and see how y'all doing and where my walkers at. <laughs> the girl back on the trail <laughs> in the cold. Oh Jesus. Ooh, I don't like cold, but uh, you got to do what you got to do, right? It's one of them, uh, I don't want to. Ooh, I don't want to part two. How about that? I don't want to walk this morning. Jesus, it's too cold. You know, y'all ever had those days where I don't want to? Well, it's one of them days. Uh, I was a little tired. I went to bed late, like too late. And uh, I didn't want to get up this morning. I mean, I want to wake up and be alive, but I didn't want to get up and, and do stuff. Y'all had one of them days? And so I said, well, got to get up, though, because uh, <laughs> hubby got appointments, and uh, you got to get up. You got to cook. I didn't want to cook. I didn't want to do nothing. <laughs> but uh, somebody was hungry, so sometimes uh, it's got to do what you don't want to do. <laughs> and that's one of them days, you know. And uh, so we finally got it together and took it to his appointment. And I said, Lord, Jesus, I don't want to go to the trail. <laughs> you know, it's like I don't want to go to the trail, but I want to go to the trail. <laughs> I just don't want to go to the trail under these conditions. That, that's what it is. You don't want to under certain conditions. You want to walk. You want to go to the trail. Uh, you don't want to go where the scope <laughs> with the girl out here. She out here, and uh, it's still gonna be good. Uh, it's gonna work for my good. Amen. Um, I was telling someone uh, yesterday, I said, you know, God said it's going to work for your good, right? I said, if God does it, it's going to work for his good. Man, if if God does it, let me, let me get it together. Get it together, girl. It's, I'm so cold about frozen. But anyway, scripture say all things work together, you know, for your good. And there are conditions, those that love him. Those that walk up right before him, he's not going to withhold no good thing from you. So, when God does it, it's going to work for your good. When man does it, it's going to work for his good. <laughs> so, everything that man does, and uh, even though it might be working for man's good, don't mean it's working for God's good. Amen. And if it ain't God's good, it ain't your good. Y'all get all this good stuff. Okay. If it ain't God's good. Uh, it ain't gonna be good for you. If this man's good, it's gonna work for me. So we pray and pray to God that uh, when we open our hearts to Him, that uh, and we allow Him to come in, and we tell God to move on our behalf. Uh, we know it's gonna work for our good. Amen. So I don't want to walk this morning, but I do. It's gonna work for my good, right? Because <laughs> I need to. The girl tired. I'm tired. But uh. Even as I'm walking, I haven't even made a lap, but just to show you when you do things that you don't want to do, uh, it'll kick in right away. Um, I'm feeling a little better already, <laughs> even though I'm cold, but my body is not as tired and I haven't even done a lap. So we have to get up sometime and make ourselves do some things that we don't want to do. I don't want to cook, <laughs> but I had to eat. Hallelujah. I don't want to drive. Ain't nobody else to drive. <laughs> you know? <sighs> I don't want to get in my car and it's 51 degrees. <laughs> 51, 51, in the car. Jeez. Do I need to go back and put an overcoat on? But I didn't. <laughs> oh, so. It's one of those days. So what is it y'all didn't want to do this morning? You might say, I don't want to carry my kids to school. <laughs> but they got to go. They got to get up out of here. <laughs> I don't want to homeschool. Uh, but you didn't want to carry them to school. <laughs> so, you know, choices, choices. You know, I don't want to go to work today. But I need the money. You know, I don't want to, I don't want two days. Anybody got one besides me? I'm being transferred. I don't want to today. I, you know, I can't stay in the bed. I don't want to stay in the bed. I don't want to get up either. <laughs> got to do something, girl. But uh, God is good. And, uh, you know, I, I don't want to. Go to my job, but you say I need the money. So go on to that job and get your money. It's definitely gonna work for your good. Amen. So it's one of those days. And uh we have to keep pushing ourselves. 
And uh, we have to keep praying and we have to keep believing God. Amen. So it's a beautiful day. Amen. How you doing? Yeah, All right. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> I'm going to part on the tree. I got a witness. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh, God. Yeah, so it's a good day that the Lord has made. I'm excited. I'm excited about Jesus. So what is it you, this morning when y'all got up, what is it that y'all didn't want to do? But you did it anyway because you knew it was going to be good for you. Amen. You might say, I don't want to clean up my house. We can't live in the dirt either. <laughs> I do have some delays in the area because I'm <laughs> allergic to dust. How you going to be allergic to dust if you know you got to clean the dust? I have to put the mask on. I have to look like I'm going to war. But uh, I have to do it. I don't want to put the mask on, but, <laughs> but I got to clean the house. So what are some things y'all didn't want to do this morning? Amen. God is good. <laughs> Now, I'm not going to say I didn't want to praise God, because I'm going to tell you right now, I want to praise God when I'm up, when I'm down. I'm going to praise Him when I don't want to. Yeah, I'm going to praise Him when I want to. Honey, that, mm -mm, I want to praise Him. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That will remain. Amen. So, I mean, that will remain. I will remain confident in this. <laughs> I'm going to praise Him because I want to. Glory to God. So, I don't want to. Hallelujah. Uh, I know that. What? This camera doing stuff, y'all. You know, flipped over to somewhere that I don't know where I'm at. <laughs> oh, so you want to go there? I didn't want to go. I didn't want to flip the camera, but it did. What's wrong with it? I guess it's cold. <laughs> but uh, I'm warming up already, y'all. When you talk about the Lord, you start warming up. So I'm warming up. So, what else going on with y'all? I don't want to move. <laughs> Your kids say, I don't want. I don't want to leave home. I want to stay with your mom. <laughs> mom be like. And you don't want to, we well, you gonna get out of here. <laughs> then when the children get out of here, they like, I want to move back home. <laughs> you know, children, <clears throat> sometimes they can't make up their mind. They, they, they want to be grown. I want to be grown. <laughs> but I don't want to move. But well, you're not going to be grown up in here. In not in here. <laughs> not in my house. <laughs> Parents, stop letting them kids take over your house. <laughs> where they ain't paying no rent. Whew, jeez. My son was coming up. I told him responsibility. I said, you go pay me some rent. <laughs> I don't care if it's $25. And, and when I gave it back to him, I didn't let him know that I gave him back his own $25. <laughs> but that's responsibility. You got to you gotta teach him. That's what you got to do. I don't care if it's $2 a week. Get them the, in the responsibility of, you know, what they should do. And train them in the way they should go. You know, uh, give them their allowance and make them pay rent. And get back to them without them knowing. <laughs> and uh, I talked that to my son. I'm telling y'all, y'all, he got that thing all pat. <laughs> if I loan him a nickel, you better get that nickel back. <laughs> he got it down, he got it down. I told him, he, he trained well. But God is good. So you get up Sundays or whatever day of the week you go to church. I don't want to go to church. It's night. I don't want to go to church. It's, it's day. <laughs> well, you don't want to go at night. You don't want to go day. Where you going? Yeah, just get up and go. Glory to God. I, I, I don't want to look at it on live stream. I don't want to at it, look at it on Facebook. I don't want to look at it on YouTube. But I need some word. <laughs> you know. So that's what happens. You know, Jesus, no doubt, didn't want to take the cup. But what did he say? He said, but not my will, but thy will be done. So he took the cup. So what if he didn't take the cup? We all would have been out here. We wouldn't have been in you. Amen. So, I'm sure he didn't want to go to the cross and let them beat him up. And put that crown of thorns on his head and pierce him in the side. And You think he wanted all that? But he did it for us. So, a lot of stuff we don't want to. I'm sure when God looked down at earth that he had made, that he made so beautiful. And everything was beautiful. And then man started acting crazy. Doing all that wicked stuff. And God looked down. Oh, this the earth I made. <laughs> he repented. He made earth. And, uh, but then he had a little mercy. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's almost like, like God may have said, oh, I ain't going to give them another chance. I don't want to. They all mean, and I created everything for, for good. And, and I'm looking out here at the world I made. And these people here, and oh, yes, they so cruel and mean. And they're doing everything that I didn't design them to do. And uh, he could have let us, or let them, I wasn't here that, that time. 
But he could have let them perish and went on. But he decided, you know, I, I, he had a little mercy. I'm going to send my son and I'm going to give him another chance. And uh, I'm going to give them a chance to redeem themselves, even if they don't want to right now. And so I'm sure, I'm sure when he turned to that son, that's the son Jesus. Tell him to send you down there. I don't know what Jesus said. He might have said, well, Dad, I don't want to. <laughs> but he went. Hallelujah. I'm glad he came. Amen, because it saved me. Hallelujah. So thank God for Jesus. Thank, thank you for coming, Jesus. Hallelujah. But had not been for you on my side, <laughs> I wouldn't have been walking the tree. I wouldn't have been here, like, period. So we're grateful for that. So, you know, I, I, I don't want to get up and put no dress clothes on today. <laughs> I better put on something. <laughs> Glory to God. I can't come out with nothing. Amen. So I don't want to, mothers, young mothers, you know, they, they think it's cute when they're pregnant and they be out there taking all them pictures with all they, all their belly out. I'm old school, so we covered up everything. So they be out there taking them beautiful pictures and, oh, oh, some of them is a little too much, but so cute. And they're carrying the baby and everybody rubbing on the stomach. <laughs> Don't rub my chest. But that's the new thing, y'all. I'm glad, glad. But anyway, and then... After them nine months or whatever your term is when it's up, and uh, baby's here. And uh, they say you got to push. I don't want to. <laughs> oh, Jesus. For the pain that's getting ready to happen. You say, I don't want to push. You got to push. You got to get up out of here. You got to get that baby out of the oven. And so they don't want to because it's painful. Sometimes we don't want to do things because it's too painful, Lord. It's too painful to push this baby out. But they say you got to push. You got to bear it out. And then. So you grind your teeth and <laughs> everything you can. <laughs> Hold on to the sheet. <laughs> and don't have nobody right there with you. Might turn that head off. Gee, ooh, I feel that pain. Ooh, come back, girl. Ooh, 44 years ago. <laughs> Over. And uh, But when they push, even though they didn't want to, but when that birth comes out, they so happy. So they're happy then. They're like, ooh, baby's out. A baby's out, but <laughs> they didn't realize they got to feed him. <laughs> got to feed the baby now. And uh, they think they're going to sleep the next morning. <laughs> Not even morning. <laughs> the baby start carrying on in the middle of the night. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to get up. I don't want to feed you. Can you wait till morning? And the baby be like, no. Ooh, no. So you got to make yourself get up. And now you all tired and you ain't got no rest. Because uh, that when the baby's inside inside of you and you out there taking all them pictures. <laughs> Who taking the pictures now? <laughs> the baby <laughs> I don't want to feed him you got to feed him got to train I don't want to train him you got to do it you got to do it amen so that's what happens <laughs> we don't want to but uh y'all some stuff you just got to do you know it's it's, it's gonna be all right I don't want to go through this pain <laughs> well I'd rather have a body that can feel pain than to have a body that don't know when they're in pain you see what I'm saying? So, we thank God for the pain. Because <laughs> uh, it's going to go away, y'all. It's going away. You know, I don't want to be sick. <laughs> well, if we were never sick, we wouldn't know what it would be like to be healed. Hallelujah. You know, God is a healer. So, I can't heal all manner of sickness and all manner of disease. Amen. So, that's how we are. I, I don't want to love them. They treated me bad. <laughs> but the words say, uh, we got to love them. We got to pray for them. got to bless them. And, Persecute us. We got love of enemies. I don't want to. They, they, they cost too much trouble. I do not want to love my enemies. Okay. They let them gave me enough hard time. I don't want to, Jesus. <laughs> but I can't call you mine. Oh, Jesus, I want to. <laughs> Change that mind quick, right? And you got to make yourself uh, do those things uh, that you don't want to. Now, some of the stuff when you say, I don't want to, you say, well, I don't want to sin. <laughs> don't sin. <laughs> do your best not to. I don't want to practice it and try to hold on to it. So you got to rightly divide that thing. Amen. I want to live for God. What, what are some things you want to do? I want to live for God. I want to be holy for God. You know, I want to act right before God and my fellow man. I can't say I love God and I hate people. They don't go together. So that's what I want to. Amen. So... Because I didn't want to walk this trail. Because <laughs> I thought it was too cold when I started. <laughs> I'm warming up now. Hallelujah. You see how it's changing already? It's working for my good. Met a little saint on the trail. And 
I was talking to John right there and said, hallelujah. <laughs> Glory to God. What if I had to been on the trail? Who wouldn't have had a witness? So God is good. So y'all, I'm going to jump off. And uh, I just want y'all to know this is a great day. <laughs> whether you want to get up or not, or whether you want to do whatever you did. I, I don't want to, I don't want to spend this money on this bill. Well, you made it. <laughs> but spend it. I don't want to pay my rent. Okay, don't pay it. <laughs> You be on the street, <laughs> evict, evicted, and then you want to know why they evict me. You don't want to pay the rent, so okay. I don't want to pay the mortgage, okay? Let them come get it. <laughs> well, I better pay the mortgage if I want somewhere to stay. So you 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 see this stuff? So it's okay. You can have your I don't want two days, but uh, you better flip the other side of it and say, what if I don't? Ah! What if I don't do it? Amen. So we got we got to make that thing balance, y'all. So that's where we at. That's where we are. So I thank the Lord that uh, it's a good day. <laughs> Regardless of my I don't want to's. But uh, I want to's outweigh my I don't want to's. And uh, I give God glory. And I give God praise. Amen. So y'all, I'm telling y'all, you know, if you take care of a loved one, I don't want to do that. You know, I got a life of my own. Well, okay, what you going to do with them? Who's going to take care of them? Okay, you either put them. In, in a facility that's not yours and you go visit them or you keep them at your place and you take care of them which, which one you gonna do which one gonna work for your good you know you say I don't want to <laughs> this too much trouble well when they had you it didn't seem to be a whole lot of trouble I tell you let me tell you something we got we got some disrespect for children in this generation I tell you, I'm so glad my son wasn't born in this generation cause I don't know if he'd be here <laughs> and not in my house Jeez. They, they very disrespect. They talk back. They do all kind of stuff. If we look like we were gonna talk back to our parents, ooh, that little back of that hand at the back, the back of, not the front, the back. Bow, get your teeth out, knocked out. And, and the day they say that child abuse, <laughs> I'm still here. <laughs> yeah, child abuse and all. Is that what they say? But uh, we live in a whole other generation. But uh, y'all stick to what's right. Amen. Don't practice what's wrong. Strive to live right, strive to live holy. Strive to be the best you that you can be. Because nobody else can be you. Amen. Nobody else can be you. When you don't want to be you, you know. Well, who's going to be you if you don't want to be you? <laughs> Did y'all get that you, you? <laughs> you, you? I'm talking you. You. And when I do what I do, <laughs> what you doing? Well, ain't nobody else, okay? Check out of here. <laughs> Next. It's like a bus. Won't roll out. <laughs> Nothing coming about 10, 20 minutes later. They'll pick up the next passenger. So, don't ever think that it won't happen if you're not around. I promise you, it will. Amen. All right, I love y'all. I'm going to get off here and it's going to be about time to go back and pick up my partner. And uh, <laughs> I guess I better want to pick him up. He'll be sitting there at his apartment. Amen. So, do good. Be good. Act right. Keep it tight. Love God. Hate sin. Not the man. Hate sin. Yeah, we be hating folk. Hate sin. And uh, not man. And uh, obey God. Hallelujah. He got some great things in store. We're almost coming to the end, really, of 2021. The years are going by faster. He's soon to come quicker than before. And uh, when you see the months going so fast that you can't keep up with the days, I'm telling y'all, that means we should be more in a hurry to want to live right. Amen. So, all my friends, all my loved ones, I love y'all. Glory to God. With the love of the Lord. <laughs> I can't, can't love y'all in my in my flesh. You know what? Before, I don't know. Think about it for a minute. They say, I love you with the love of the Lord. Well, Jesus loved unconditionally. Do you really love me with the love of the Lord? Do you really love me when I don't act right? Do you really love me that my attitude is jacked up? Do you, do you really love me with the love of the Lord? Do you really love me when I won't do what you want me to do? Do you really love me with the love of the Lord? Okay, I know you don't want to, but do you? <laughs> so think about that thing. We say a whole bunch of stuff. I'm blessed and highly favored. What does that mean? Is it flavor or favor? <laughs> okay. Uh, Jesus' favorite uh, Mary, when he uh, put the sun inside her. Now, that's real favor right there. So, think about what we be saying. Some things are cliches, but think about what are you saying. Amen. 
All right, y'all. <laughs> I'm out because I've been came up with something else. It's whatever drops, that's what comes out. <laughs> so I don't want to come up with nothing else because I'm getting ready to stop. At least I got warm. I'm warmer. All right, y'all be good. And I want y'all to know this, glory be to Jesus, this is the best day. Hallelujah. Amen. This is the best morning. Nice and refreshed morning. A glorious morning. A hallelujah morning. A cool morning. But I done got warmed up because I got talked about Jesus. I got to get all hot. But it's the best one. Hallelujah. That I will ever have today. And uh, all that stuff y'all don't want to. <laughs> think about what if you don't do it. Alright, catch it.